and welcome back to Lost in Random. Let's hope we'll find space but over here. Oh, there is something. There will be enemies, right? Yeah, there probably will be enemies. It looks like a complete trap. Town Third. Town the third of his name, the comfort plushy and soft protector of the permanent count of three. Looks kinda like the plushie we gave our sister. Kinda. Really? Just can I not do one thing if I don't think that's not that? It's even more of me. Come on, everyone, pick it up. There's really lots of people. Come on, everyone, over here. Let's seriously get over here so I can use it. Nothing useful. Um, I can't. I can't even get that. Which means I'm gonna get in the ocean. <laughs> That's all. Bomb, please, 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 bomb. Um, I was a little bit 
Spawnen jetzt. We can play everything for the show. We play that for sure. I guess we get that. That was a mistake. It's a very horrible mistake. Please give me more big enemies because they are a whole lot easier to deal with. Now let's go back to the crown. All bets are off when you've got a new card from old Maddie Dex. Okay. This Maybe we should buy some new cards. Hmm. Maybe we should wait for a new. But on Dicey. I don't know. Can we get better cards? Also, we have enough. Yeah, Here, mate. This okay, fine. I really like this card. We do the cops. I really like this one as well. Ooh, that's one. Lance of Four. The spirit of the ruined Four Town manifesting the shapes, shape of Lance. I got too bad. By accident, it was an accident. Let's see. Let's get, let's get rid of... Where is it? This. Can give me that. Continue. Mm, oh, it's my sole purpose in life. <laughs> go. Thank you much. Let me go. Thank you. There you go, you're flashy. Oh, Shmoo, you're back! You lovable little scamp! I should scold you. You had me worried to death! Oh, but I can't stay mad at that face. 
Here you go. By the card makers, Count Schmoo the Third, you're back Why home with Daddy. Why isn't that You've done good here today, noble child. You've returned my Schmoo to me, which is just about the exact opposite of assassinating me. I'm forever in your debt. You and now let me give you this finger. It's yours. I hope that with it, you can uncover the truth of my father's murder. Where's the finger from exactly? The crime scene. One of my servants found it there. It's been long since replaced by a battlefield, but go on, take it, carry it with pride. Thanks. So now there's only a sister left. It looks like a, not like a finger, but like a working glove, you know. A shriveled pinky radiating evil. This trigger of memory, Nishka. Only one way to find out. Yeah. I guess. So now we have to activate the sister. Let's see. The map. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I hope I'm going the right way. Yep. No, it took nearly 1,000 coins. 160 by accident because it that clicked fast. Oh, you. You don't fit in here, my dear. No, I don't. Don't tell anyone, but I'm actually a not owner. Oh, I most certainly will not. Anything to break up the tedium of war and these endless parties. Why, you may be our only hope, dear. Why? My brother, Arthur. You remind me of him. He was a soldier, and I see the same determination in your eyes, child. Ah, I do wonder what's become of him. I think I met him. He misses you too. Well, dear, aren't you a ray of sunshine on a rainy day? My only brother. Still out there? Thank you. You've raised this old fool's spirits. You will. So, ooh. I know we can move on. Ten hut recruits for the Baroness has won the role. All hail her rule and her rules. We should be able to go down here. Yep, it is cleared up. Oi, oi, looking to get an invincibility potion, are you? Well, you've come to the wrong place. Wait. What's hard, though? She's still the Baroness for me. I was here. Which means I have no idea. Step 
I don't understand this war or this town I'm here because my sister was taken. Oh, no, we have, oh, we have to find it. I'm here because, yep, because my sister's missing and I bet there's someone you know, someone you love that you want to see again. Forget the triplets. Don't fight for anyone, Pip. Uh, fight for the Pip, the Pip you want to be. I'm gonna die in battle soon, and I did feel bad about it. <laughs> but now I feel fine about it. <laughs> Is there any way I can help? Nah, kid, I'm feeling no pain these days. <laughs> You need to come down. Mm, mm. You need to stop bothering strangers, kid. Shoo. Now, shoo. Shoo. Hmm. I haven't seen the page at all. Buttons. Lots of buttons. War! Welcome to Warrior's Training! Way mm -hmm. better than that calm breathing fella! Let's begin by chugging a pint of Zupa juice! Um, okay. Ah, that's what I like to hear. Now that our thirst has been sated, let's carefully stretch things out. Warriors protect their joints. Ah, now for axe training. Swing wide. Imagine you're chopping down a tree. Imagine you're chopping down an enemy. Imagine you're chopping down a friend. You just murdered your friend with an axe. What? You're a warrior. I think I mean, this is the most amazing thing I've ever seen. Warriors don't think, they war! That's why it's called Warrior! Now we're working on our battle cries! We need to scream so that our enemies know that we're here! So they can be afraid and they die of fear! Can you scream hard enough to make strangers die? <laughs> Yes! Finally, let's focus on our motivation! Do warriors need motivation? No! Motivation is for actors! But they do need battle zone inspirations! So think of who you're fighting for. Is it glory? No! Is it one of the triplets? No! You're fighting for war, because war needs warriors, and warriors need war. So every war you war yourself into is a new war for warriors. Have I said war enough that the word war no longer has any war meaning? Yes. War. War. Even wondered what she'd been caught up in. Oh, but at least she felt motivated. 
that concludes Warriors <laughs> Workout. Find another warrior way. Go ahead. Oh my god, there's no way. Okay, oh, there is a way. Oh, wait. <laughs> now this. Give me that. The fight. That's the one. But no game lasts forever. And there came a day when some of Random's grandest champions found themselves hungering greedily. But challenges more deadly than had ever been encountered before. And with rewards commensurate with their risk. And their demands were soon met by new and darker games. Whose stakes were as dangerous as could be imagined. And those are the sisters. Girl who wants to trade cards. I got good news for you. <laughs> I think the queen is one of the sisters. Oh no, I need to get over there. That's a kid. boy. <laughs> You really, yeah. That's one of the kids. I need to get to. Oh. I'm a little really thing about that. The Baroness lived atop Wild Card Hill. Training ground for war and a home to warriors. It was not a place for children. But then again, thought even, what part of freedom was? Cards, cards, yes. Two cards. Okay. And immediately I wasted. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. That was me. Oh, God damn it. Okay. I hate you. I really hate you. Take it now. Go take it, please. Yes, I'm going to use them again. Yes, I'm going to use them again. And do I feel bad about that? No. There you go. Oh. 
Oh, really? Oh, that's all. That's all. Great. Oh, that's not all. That's definitely not all. Did I hit? This is. I've changed my mind. Since being the game, I love heavy weapons. <laughs> Interlopers find themselves dead long before this point. What's wrong with your face? Dang, how did a child like you make it up here? Mm, I guess it's all your clunky minions. Ha, a likely story. You must have just snuck past them. Blind chance. At ease, child. My name is Even. Well then, at ease, Even. Look at you. You're not even old enough to be a recruit. You're soft, aren't you? Um, better than being mean. <laughs> mean? It's just a compliment the weak pay you when they can't help but respect your authority. And I can see you respect mine. You'd be mm -hmm. a fool not to. What can I do for you, even? Tell me about the war. Simple thing, really, but it requires complicated strategy. One or both of my brothers defeated our bodyguard and killed our father. I don't let that stand, soldier, so I fight. And when I win, they will pay for their transgressions. You but Nishka, she's alive. Not surprised. Nishka's damn tough. And if anyone could survive out there, it's her. She taught me how to win a fight. Taught me how to never surrender. Taught me the importance of duty. Come with me and visit her. No, that would be a dereliction of duty. 
She wouldn't be happy to see me there, and neither would I. What? I respect us both too much for that. How is she, other than alive? She's not well. It's hard to remember who killed your father if you could visit. Impossible! I am too busy waging and winning this war. Would you give me something that would remind her of you? <laughs> a child coming here and asking for a gift. The sheer gall. But I admire the courage. Tell you what, even. I happen to own the mighty mechanical arm that once belonged to Nishka. If you can take it, it's yours. Mm, her arm will remind Nishka of you. If not... It ought to remind her of a failure to protect my father. This arm. It's only the most heavily guarded item in my entire freedom. Right. I like your spunk, even. So let me warn you. You will fail. You may even die. So mm. do the smart thing and go back to whatever teapot shack you came from. What is exactly do you do here? Fight war, soldier. That's what leaders do. And great leaders, well, they win them. My brothers have been a blight on this land for too long. Anyway. Do you think you'll defeat your brothers? Ha! Me? Lose against a soft esthete and a shrill maniac? <laughs> Impossible. Even if they had the sense to ally against me. I would have won today, actually, if only my maneuvers hadn't been interfered with by those blasted colossuses. They're supposed to move just once a day. It's highly irregular, recruit. I, I it will say who moved the colossi. <laughs> right. A little girl controls the movements of the giants. Yes. Tell me the other one. I moved them with my dice. If that were true... You'd be the most dangerous thing on the planet. Yeah. And you wouldn't know what power you are wielding. It simply couldn't be true. How did your father die? Suddenly, I think. I found him too late. The murder weapon was still there. But someone took it and stashed it inside the head of his own personal giant robot. The robot's long since destroyed now. The queen of all random had it dismantled after my father died. I think she feared the old man, and that his murder came as a dark blessing to her rule. Ah, but you didn't hear that from me. Okay. <laughs> Even knew what she needed to do to get something that would jog Nishka's memory. Win the most protected treasure in the most militarized kingdom. Yeah. She knew it would be hard, but she also knew that the chance of ending this war, if indeed she could end it, would be worth it. Okay, yeah, that we're gonna do it next time. So, for now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye!